today, the underwater search begins. Two naval vessels now on location, scouring a single 150-mile track within the new search area. The ships, outfitted with the US Navy's unmanned underwater robot and black box detector, Australian authorities say they're confident in their refined search zone. The area of highest probability as to where the aircraft might have entered the water is the area uh, where the underwater search will commence. But the Ocean Shield and HMS Echo are racing against time as the batteries powering the black box pinger are expected to run out any day now. We're now getting pretty close to the time uh, when it might uh, it might expire. Today, Australia announced they're a partner in the investigation with Malaysia and are taking the lead in the search. This as 14 aircraft and nine ships are on the lookout for large objects that may be related to missing flight 370. We're looking for something big uh, and uh, unfortunately uh, all the leads we got from the satellites turned out to be uh, other things.